On behalf of TVLesson.com, I'm Dylan Schiavone, and I'm a professional guitar player here in South Florida. In this clip, I'm going to talk about proper left-hand guitar technique. Okay, when I say proper, this is not something that it's proper because it was handed down from a book. It's just proper because it makes certain things that you want to play easier and more doable to play. Okay, uh, how, what is the, the correct way to hold your left hand? Um, now the, the quick answer to that is that there is no one way because it all depends on what you're going to play. Um, that being said, a generalization is this. This is the correct way to hold the guitar. It's not, not like this that you see in the guitar magazine sometime or you know, like that. It's the easiest, most ergonomic, wrist is fairly straight, like this. Now as I go up the neck, my thumb might want to come up, which is actually good because oftentimes when we're playing up here, we're going to be doing string bendings and you really need the thumb for leverage when you do that. Look at all the pictures of all the great players, Steve Ray Vaughan, Jimi Hendrix, they all got their thumb peeking over the top, especially Clapton when they're playing, when they're bending notes. Because if I don't have my thumb up here, what happens? My hand wants to, wants to do that. So left hand positioning is very dynamic, which means if you're play, it's going to look one way here, it's going to look another way here, but generally speaking, it's a very relaxed grab. A next very important concept is to always play as close to the fret you, as you can get without actually being on it, um, like this. If you take notice, I'm not even looking at the guitar, but each finger is right next to the fret. And the importance of that is the place where I can press the least and still get a good tone is right next to the fret. If I'm pressing next to the fret, and I don't press any harder, but I just move it to the left a little, I have to press harder in order to get that same pitch out. So playing next to the fret enables us not to have to use any excess hand energy to get the same job done. On behalf of TVLesson.com, this has been Dylan Schiavone. Thank you for watching.